Hello friends, welcome to A to Z Dentistry. This video focuses on important MCQs related to mandibular fracture. Fracture of mandible common at angle of mandible, coronoid process, condylar process, body of mandible. Angle of mandible. Most common site of mandibular fracture is angle of mandible. Bucket handle type of fracture seen in children, young adult, soldiers, dangerous patients. Dangerous patients. Bucket handle type of fracture seen in dangerous patients. Fracture with damage of inferior alveolar nerve is a type of simple fracture, compound fracture, complex fracture, green stick fracture. Complex fracture. Complex fracture associated with adjacent soft tissue injury. Fracture with injury to inferior alveolar nerve is an example of complex fracture. Incomplete fracture seen in young children. Simple fracture, compound fracture, complex fracture, green stick fracture. Green stick fracture. It is a fracture in which one cortex of the bone broken with other cortex being bent. It is an incomplete fracture seen in young children. Most common pathognomonic sign of Mandibular fracture, deranged occlusion, displacement, sublingual hematoma, open bite. Sublingual hematoma. It is the best pathognomonic sign for mandibular fracture. In which mandibular fracture, tongue falls backward. Symphysis fracture, bilateral mandibular body fracture. Bilateral parasymphysis fracture, bilateral angle fracture. Bilateral parasymphysis fracture. In dislocated condylar fracture, condyle is dislocated medially due to pull of medial tergoid, medially due to pull of lateral tergoid, laterally due to pull of lateral tergoid. Laterally due to pull of medial tergoid. Medially due to the pull of lateral tergoid. Medially displaced condylar fractures are best visualized on Waters view, PA view, occipital mental view, OPG. PA view. Medially displaced condylar fractures are best visualized on PA view or posterior anterior view. Direct interdental wiring known as eyelid wiring, resistance wiring, Gilmer's wiring, all of the above. Gilmer's wiring. A direct interdental wiring is known as Gilmer's wiring. A resistant wiring indicated for angle fracture, coronary fracture, symphysis fracture, body fracture. Symphysis fracture. A resistant wiring indicated for symphysis fracture. Mini plate fixation effective at zone of tension. Zone of compression near the mandible foramen near the roots of teeth. Zone of tension. Mini plate fixation effective at zone of tension. Optimum length of screw for fixation of mini plate in mandible 2 mm, 3 mm, 4 mm, 6 mm. 4 mm. 
optimum length of screw for the fixation of mini plate in mandible is 4 mm. Minimum number of screws for the fixation of mini plate are 2 screws on each side of fracture line. Shambi's plates are semi-rigid fixation with monocortical screws, semi-rigid fixation with bicortical screws, rigid fixation with monocortical screws, rigid fixation with bicortical screws. Semi-rigid fixation with monocortical screws. Treatment of choice of a linear non-displaced fracture of body of mandible with full complement of teeth. Circumferential wiring, external pin fixation, interdental fixation, none of the above. Interdental fixation. Lower lip paresthesia seen in coronal fracture, condylar fracture, body fracture, symphysis fracture. Body fracture. Lower lip paresthesia seen in mandibular body fracture. It's all about the topic mandibular fracture. Thank you.